welcome back to your maths class children now today we are going to do an activity from areas and boundary chapter right and the activity is on your textbook that is math magic and the page number is 150 that is 150 page number 150 it is a puzzle it says can you pass through this postcard and the answer is yes i can pass through this postcard but then how let us see and let us do that as an activity we will slit this postcard in such a way that we can pass through it go through it okay now let us go to the activity now first things first we have to have a pencil or a pen okay and of course yes to do any activity in maths we do need scale scale is a very useful tool you know it, it helps you to measure straight lines and it helps you to make a different uh, sort of uh, you know shapes you can also make a circle using a scale did you know that if you want to see I can show show that to you okay but when we are not doing that so since I said that let me show you uh, uh, just just a small uh, I will make a you know a crescent okay I will not make a circle altogether but I can make you a small uh, uh, what do you call uh, a crescent sort okay with a scale okay I'm not using any see did you see how I make that so if you turn the scale uh, all around 360 degrees it will be a circle anyways that's not the activity that we are doing we are doing can we pass through this a4 sheet of paper and for that we have to draw some diagram now before we do draw the diagram I told we need a scale a pencil and a pair of scissors okay now let us start drawing the design first before we cut the paper so first of all we'll make lines all around the paper okay and then I'll tell you what we are going to do with that okay first let us mark all the sides the same side okay same all the side has to be same okay now the other side okay just pay attention to what I'm doing and you'll see we can make that we can pass through that okay now and one more line in the center of the paper so that will be your mark okay now let us make the lines here see can you see that line proper okay now first make all the lines that touches both of the edges both the edges okay the this side and this side let's say this side is edge a and this side is edge b okay so after one scales gap okay one scale breadth we are drawing the lines okay that those are straight lines that are coming up that i'm drawing okay now it has to be straight okay don't make it crooked and anyways uh, when you are drawing with scale and when you are working with maths and you know what there is a different division of maths which is called geometry that you will learn in higher classes okay now since we have done this these are the lines we have done now what we have to do is we have to segregate the lines even further now so this will be your first cut here can you see this can you see this this will be your first 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 cut okay now we are going to draw lines over here again now this will not touch the bottom okay mm, okay so these lines have to touch all the way up and down I did a little mistake maybe okay not a problem okay let us learn by doing mistakes there's a very good saying you know a very wise man said if you know how to make mistakes that means you know how to invent new things 
See, because if you don't make mistakes in life, how would you ever come up with something new? You think the first man who flew the aeroplane, he did not make any mistakes. He made lots of mistakes. And from his mistakes, he learned. Learning from your mistakes is what makes you wise. And if you keep on repeating your mistakes in life, then you will not be called wise. Then people will call you a fool. Yes. Now, since we have these lines, see, all through from this edge to this edge. Now, okay, now we will have a center line, okay, in between them. So we are going from here to there, okay, and here to here. So these are the lines that are in between, in between. See, that is why first we did the whole paper. Now these lines, I will show you, I will mark it here, okay, these lines. Can you see these? Can you see these? These are lines that are not touching the edge of the, these, these, these points, these lines are not touching the edge, okay? Can you see on the top? Not touching the edge. So similarly, we will do the whole page like that, okay? And then we will cut it with the help of a scissors, pair of scissors. Whoop. A point here, a point there, then again, a point here and a point there and the last one okay okay this and this now the this is the line that we will start cutting from so this line we will cut okay and the center line also has to be cut okay and then i will show you how to do that okay now this line you don't cut it all the way through here this doesn't have to you don't have to cut this till here otherwise this paper will come out so you don't cut here not here and not here okay similarly over on this corner the last one not here and not here it only has to cut this part can you see the zigzag line only that line has to cut okay now let us do the cutting okay now uh like I said, we have to cut this. So let me take a make a fold here so that it is easy for me to cut it. The first cut, can you see? I, I, I take the paper, okay, now fold it in the center. You have made the line and then we'll cu cut it from here. Okay, all the way. Okay, there you go. Till the line, till the line, okay? Till the line, it has to be till the line, okay? Now, say the same way we will do the other side, okay? Can you see that? I have cut. You don't cut that part, okay? Till, till there only, only till there, okay? Now, we also have to cut the center, it says, okay? But before we cut the center, we will cut the dotted parts, okay? The dotted parts. Now, let me fold the paper properly and cut the dot ones okay i'm cutting the dot okay till that line center then till the dot only till the dot there you go only till the dot there you go till the dot till the dot okay now we have cut the dot dotted lines yes the dots that we made we have cut that line now what is the next thing that we have to do the next thing we have to do is now we will cut this this part okay we will have to cut this till there okay 